Nice hand for Jay Black, ladies and gentlemen. Jay Black. Do we have single people here? We, they usually have more energy because they have a soul. Single people. If I could give one bit of advice, single people, never have the conversation, how many people were you with before you were with me? You don't want to know. I had this conversation with my wife accidentally. Because I found out when she was in college, she spent a semester in Ireland. And this disturbed me, because ladies, you like the Irish guys, and no, you do. I've read your romance novels. So I said to my wife, when you were in Ireland, were you with a lot of guys? And her answer was, don't worry about it. <laughs> Which is not a good answer, right? Because women have a particular kind of math when it comes to hooking up. If she says two, it probably means five. If she says five, it probably means 10. And if she says, don't worry about it, it means they're singing folk songs about her in Ireland as we speak. There is a statue of her in Dublin that boys touch for good luck when they turn 13. I, I flew here today from uh, the Philadelphia area. I, uh, I, I lost weight, I lost 65 pounds. And don't, don't applaud, I didn't work out, so everything is bad. It looks like they made a wax sculpture for me, then left it in the sun, everything droops. But I had to lose weight, because I know I was getting fat, because every time I get on a plane, everybody with an open seat next to him would give me that look like, oh no. <laughs> don't let him sit next to me, because it's hard being next to a big person. I was on a plane, there was a woman next to me. So much of her, was on me, we hit turbulence, and technically, I cheated on my wife. Which is, a lot of these jokes are like Ikea furniture. I just give you all the parts, and then you put them together yourselves. So I'm just making sure. Did she ask you how many people you had been with before you got married? She knew. She, she did? She looked at me and went, mm-hmm, no, you're good. Yeah. Oh, because you were really heavy. Yeah, I was heavy, I was dorky, I was, you know, I did a lot of conversation about Dungeons and Dragons thinking that oh, was Oh, yeah, dirty. yeah. In fact, my wife, we met, and two weeks after we met, she went to Paris. She had a Paris uh, vacation plan. That's part of your swag bag right. for them? Yeah, that's I, every time. You I'm sent like, them off to Jeter. Paris. And she came back early and didn't tell me, and she knocked on the door, and I came downstairs, and I greeted her at the door, and I said, you, you cannot come up right now. And she said, oh, well, why not? And I said, I didn't know you were coming back. My D&D uh, &D group is playing right now, and I can't have anybody over during the D&D &D group. And there was a pause, and she said, I would have been more comfortable had you had another woman. <laughs> it would have been better if you were banging so Like my sister, it would have been better if you were banging oh, my sister than playing Dungeons and Dragons. <laughs> How did you lose all the weight? How did I lose all the weight? I did lose it on the iPhone. It was an app that you have. You guys know the app? Oh yeah, Lose I do it? know that one. Lose How many it. people are with the LA girls know? Yeah. Look at her, she's, a, she's 68 pounds. <laughs> she's the Tracy Gold after picture. She, she could fit in your, your kid's car seat in the she back could. of your car. She, she'd have to legally drive in a car seat. If you were dating yeah, her, you'd that's be like, right. you'd get pulled over and you're like, legally she should be in a, a car suit. And an infant seat. 60. And I love backwards. women because she's like, mm hmm that's good. That's good. No, I am dangerously underweight. It's good. <laughs> no. No, was, how was the show? It was wonderful. Someone said I was dangerously underweight. I'm really <laughs> excited. I think my career is going to go very good places now that I'm dangerously underweight. Someone told me a funny joke the other day. They said, uh, they said honey, tell me how many people you're with before you married me. Yeah. And she goes, oh, sweetie, don't, don't make me do that. No, no, really, honey, I want to... So the, hus so the wife goes... Uh, no, the husband goes... <laughs> I'm the worst <laughs> joke teller. The husband goes... Uh, yeah, the husband goes... <laughs> Uh, let's see, so with one, two, three, four, and then you. Yeah. And then six, seven, <laughs> eight, nine. My, so, my wife, I'm gonna just, I'm gonna say this honestly, my wife said, you can go out on the road and I'm not worried about you cheating on me. And I was like, oh, because you know that I'm a good person? And she said, no, because lightning doesn't strike twice. Oh. And I thought that was uh, hurtful. I thought that was very hurtful that she would say that to me. That is and hurtful. ladies, prove her wrong. Come on, let's make that happen. <laughs> Under Underweight person thinks so. Yeah. yeah, no. That doesn't even count as having sex because under 70 pounds, that does not even, that doesn't count. <laughs> under 70 pounds, that's like masturbating with a big hand. Yeah, that's right. <laughs> Jay Black, ladies and gentlemen, Jay Black. Thank you very much, everybody. Good night. Fantastic. Fantastic.